So let's just get to it. Are you getting a second stimulus check from the government? The answer is probably yes. So congratulations, you will most likely get a second stimulus check from the government. Now, when are you gonna get it and how much is it gonna be? Those are the million dollar questions we're gonna answer in today's video. I'm Joshua Roberts, attorney at law, and you are watching Lawyer Up. If you enjoy the uh, video, hit that like button. If you got something to say, comment below. If you want to learn more, subscribe to the channel. And as always, share me on social media. So the first question is, why do I think you're going to get a second stimulus check? Well, because the Democrats have said so, the Republicans have said so, and the president has said so. And when all three of those agree on something, it usually happens. Specifically during an interview the last week of June, the president was asked, do you think there's going to be a second stimulus check? And here's his exact response. President Trump said, yeah, we are, we are. We will be doing another stimulus package. It'll be very good, it'll be generous. That was his exact quote. So, like I said, when the government's in agreement and they're all on the same page, it's likely to happen. The next question is, how much are you going to get? And we don't know for sure, but we can estimate by kind of going back and looking at what the Congress has done over the past four months. Now, remember the first stimulus check that went out. That was part of the Republican-sponsored CARES Act, and that was at the end of March. And that gave $1,200 to every adult who was making less than $75,000 a year. Uh, between $75,000 and $100,000, you got a reduced amount. And then it was completely phased out over $100,000 per person of income. Those same people also got $500 per child as long as they didn't make more than the $100,000 per year. Now that bill was signed into law and those checks went out. Since that time, the Democrats have put forth their own proposal. And this was called the HEROES Act, and a component of that was a second stimulus check. And the particulars were another $1,200 check for all adult Americans who are making less than $100,000 per year. Interestingly, the HEROES Act had uh, those adults getting another $1,200 per child. So instead of the $500 uh, under the CARES Act, the proposal was $1,200 per child, uh, up to a limit of three children. So for a household, the most you could get was $6,000, and that was under the HEROES Act. Now that act, as you know, did not pass. It passed the House, but it didn't pass in the Senate, so it was never presented uh, to the president for signature but it does give us some idea of what the Democrats are thinking on the second round of stimulus checks. And you may have heard some other proposals from the Democrats about $2,000 per adult and $2,000 per child, uh, but that really hasn't gained any traction. So the likelihood of a stimulus check that large being sent out is probably unlikely. However, what Democrats and Republicans seem to agree upon is this $1,200 per adult figure. Why $1,200? Who knows? But both sides seem to agree on that figure. So when we're thinking about uh, how much we're likely to get, $1,200 per adult is probably gonna be very close to what the ultimate bill and law will be. In addition, the range for the check per child is probably going to be somewhere between the original $500 and the proposed $1,200 by the Democrats. Somewhere in between there is likely where that check per child will fall. So depending upon your situation, uh, whether you're married, how much money you make, and how many kids you have, you can kind of calculate uh, and plan for the amount of money you're likely to get in the next round of stimulus checks. The next big question then turns to when are these checks gonna come out? And there's no clear answer to that question. Uh, what we do know is that at the end of June, Congress was wrestling with the uh, adjustments to the use of force laws 
laws as they apply to the police uh, after the George Floyd uh, incident and then subsequent protests. Uh, that is likely to spill over uh, past the 4th of July. Now, significantly is the two weeks that follow the 4th of July, that is their summer break. So Congress won't be in session at all. So the earliest that Congress could convene and start discussing the second stimulus check that would come to you is July 20th. And it's very likely the first thing that they deal with is they try to finalize the issue with the uh, police conduct and use of force issues. Uh, so let's just estimate that in the following week, they finally get around to talking about a fourth stimulus package, including the second check coming out to Americans. That puts us basically at the 1st of August. Uh, and if you remember the timeline under the CARES Act, it took about two weeks to pass uh, the House and then the Senate and then get to the president's desk for signature. Uh, so that will push us uh, to mid-August. Uh, last time under the CARES Act, once the president signed it, it still took another three weeks for the IRS to start sending out checks. So if you add all that up, we're looking at uh, mid-September before these checks at the earliest start rolling out. Uh, and the timing kind of makes sense because uh, they want these checks coming out in September and October because that's the month right before the November presidential election. So both parties are going to want to be able to claim some sort of a victory in being able to have these checks issued. So the most likely time frame will be right before the election, end of September and throughout the month of October. So that's the summary on the fourth stimulus package that's probably coming out. Uh, the second uh, check that would be issued to you. And in conclusion, is it likely you're getting a second stimulus check? Yes. How much will it be? Probably $1,200 per adult plus somewhere between $500 and $1,200 per child. And when are you gonna get it? Mid-September at the earliest, but probably sometime during October for sure, because you know those politicians wanna take credit for it. Well, that's the episode. I hope you liked it. If you did, hit that like button. If you wanna know more, subscribe to the channel. If you got something to say to me or a question, put it in the comments below. And as always, share me on social media. I appreciate you watching. My name is Joshua Roberts, attorney at law, and you've been watching Lawyer Up. Send lawyers, guns, and money. Dad, get me out of this.